A cone of diameter 50 mm and axis height 60 mm is lying on the ground vertically. It is cut by a plane perpendicular to VP. That means it is seen as line in front view and inclined at 70 degrees to HP and passes through the apex. Draw the sectional plan and true shape of the section. Okay. Now, if the section plane is passing through apex, then the shape will be a an isosceles triangle. Why? Because uh, think about the generator of a cone. The, the all the generators of the cone originating are ending at the apex. So if is if you notice the section plane, it is that section plane as line can be considered as the generator of course. So generator is a straight edge. That is why the true shape is a triangle, isosceles triangle whose sides are equal to the generator length, slant edge length. This is the problem. With respect to that, complete the uh, top view and front view first. Then introduce the section plane through O dash. Draw a 75 degree line. Okay, it it passes through the it starts from apex apex and ends at uh, the base. So one O dash is one cutting point. You have another two cutting points here. Only three cutting points. One, two, and three. One, two, and three. Darken portion remaining. Draw projectors and get the cutting points in top view. Uh, the line joining 1, 2 is a straight line. You, can, you should use scale also for 2, 3. The 1, 2, 3 is a triangle. Using scale, connect these three points. Should not You should not draw by free hand. Has this area that completes the sectional top view. Draw x1, y1. With respect to that, get the cutting points in uh, true shape. Join the points 1, 1, 2, 1, 3, 1 using scale because it is a triangle and has this area that is the answer. 